Since we can't have a Sunday School Christmas program this year, today we want to share the Christmas story with you. Or we'll read from the Gospels of Luke and Matthew using the International Children's Bible. At that time, Augustus Caesar sent an order to all people in the countries that were under Roman rule. The order said that they must list their names in a register. This was the first registration taken while Quirinius was governor of Syria. And everyone went to their own towns to be registered. So Joseph left Nazareth, a town in Galilee. He went to a town of Bethlehem in Judea. This town was known as the town of David. Joseph went there because he was from the family of David. Joseph registered with Mary because she was engaged to marry him. Mary was now pregnant. While Joseph and Mary were in Bethlehem, the time came for her to have the baby. She gave birth to her first son. There were no rooms left in the inn, so she wrapped the baby with cloths and laid him in a manger. That night, some shepherds were in the field nearby watching their sheep. An angel of the Lord stood before them. The glory of the Lord was shining around them, and suddenly they became very frightened. The angel said to them, Don't be afraid, because I am bringing you some good news. It will be a joy to all the people. Today your Savior was born in David's town. He is Christ the Lord. This is how you will know him. You will find him wrapped in cloths and lying in a manger. Then a very large group of angels from heaven joined the first angel. All the angels were praising God, saying, And on earth let there be peace to the people who please God. Then the angels left the shepherds and went back to heaven. The shepherds said to each other, Let us go to Bethlehem and see this thing that has happened. We will see this thing the Lord told us about. So the shepherds went quickly and found Mary and Joseph. And the shepherds saw the baby lying in the manger. Then they told what the angels had said about this child. Everyone was amazed when they heard what the shepherds had said to them. Mary hid these things in her heart. She continued to think about them. Then the shepherds went back to their sheep, praising God and thanking Him for everything that they had seen and heard. It was as the angel had told them. Jesus was born in the town of Bethlehem in Judea during the time when Herod was king. After Jesus was born, some wise men from the east came to Jerusalem. They asked, Where is the baby who was born to be the king of the Jews? We saw his star in the east. We came to worship him. When King Herod heard about the new king of the Jews, he was troubled, and all the people in Jerusalem were worried too. Herod called a meeting of all the leading priests and teachers of the law. He asked them where Christ would be born. They answered, In the town of Bethlehem in Judea, the prophet wrote about this in the scriptures. But you, Bethlehem, in the land of Judah, you are important among the rulers of Judah. A ruler will come from you. He will be like a shepherd for my people. The Israelites. Then Herod had a secret meeting with the wise men from the east. He learned from them the exact time they first saw the star. Then Herod sent the wise men to Bethlehem. He said to them, Go and look carefully to find a child. When you find him, come tell me. Then I can go worship him too. The wise men heard the king and then left. They saw the same star that they had seen in the east. It wouldn't be for them until it stopped above the place where the child was. 
When the wise men saw the star, they were filled with joy. They went to the house where the children was and saw him with his mother Mary. They bowed down and worshipped the child. They opened the gifts they brought for him. They gave him treasures of gold, frankincense, and myrrh. But God warned the wise men in a dream not to go back to Herod. So they went home to their own country by a different way. <laughs>